Hola a todos, aquí la parte 4 del episodio 3 de The One Amor Us. Y bien, lo dejé exactamente acá en primera discusión con esta bruja, que por fin lo encontramos. Y bueno, eh, antes de continuar, vamos al libro de fábula de nuevo, a leer estas dos que apareció. El Bad de Tristrat, el bien más antiguo de la ciudad de Nueva York. Starcar, el legendario y el probo vikingo, la fusión secreta de 1725, para que las fábulas tuvieran lugar para reunirse a beber y contarse sus penas. Se llamaba la tomada de Gramico, pero esta no le perdió una apuesta con un tipo de troll y montañas que se adueñaron del establecimiento y le cambiaron el nombre. Holly es la propietaria actual. Los herederos de su madre cuando esta murió, esta murió en un accidente náutico a principios del siglo XX. Auto y Grena, eh, eh, venado blanco, horticultora, alquimista y amante de los animales. Una de las pocas brujas negadas que todavía vive fuera del piso 13, sin supervisión ni restricciones. Su moneda que perdió una hija en la tierra natales, por eso sufre un paranoico en la habilidad mencionada. Solo sale exterior en la nena mala, y transforma en un exterior venado blanco, un espectro de que habla en voz debajo del activo de los crán. ¿Y por qué cuando se enoja la bruja, como si la casa empieza a moverse? ¿Por qué será? Algo va a pasar ahí. Vale, bueno, continuamos. Lo dejé exactamente acá. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love. Die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. I'm sorry, Sheriff, but please, don't do this. No, you're really not right. right. The tree has to go. No, look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girls' speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. Just please, you can catch him if you leave, okay? Just leave, and don't... Don't burn my tree. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Don't destroy it, please. This whole story of yours better check out. It will, it will. We can always come back later. Even after I told you everything? That's it? She's off the hook? Come on, we have to get to Crane while he's still there. Hey, si no Chao, despídete tu álbum. Don't think this is over. I won't. Creo que ya falta poco para terminar con este episodio. Su auto. No está por aquí. No, es nada que necesitas concernarte con él. No creo que sí, por lo menos. Espera. Oh, ¿te has visto el spot? Mr. Clean, come to smash up the rest of my place. Oh, I see. Come to audition, you bitch. Where's Crane? Ichabod Crane? What would that nerd have with a place like this? Tell me what you know now. Hmm. <laughs> I get that. For it. Hey, you can't just go in there. We have a problem. Tell me who did it. Just tell me who did it. I know you know. Mr. Crane, please. She can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. I can't. I can't. I'm sorry. I... You both know what's going on. Just tell me. Oh, my God. Bigby. Wait, don't. I, I, I didn't do anything. I promise you, I didn't do anything. These girls, the, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I ju just have to get the stupid ring working, that's all. They can't talk because of that spell. But once this ring gets through... 
I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all. Please. I'm innocent. Completely, completely innocent. It's just... Just let me show you. Maldito cabrón. Uh, wait. I can't... You have to just give me the chance. This will work. I assure you. Everything will be solved. I... I went to... You... Damn you, come on. Please. Tell me who killed her. My lips are sealed. Bueno, ya estamos, creo que ya estamos al final ya de este episodio, así que voy a aprovecharle las fábulas que me aparecieron, creo que dos más. Sí. Tubo de encanto. El disfraz asequible. Hay varias maneras de fabricar encanto, pero una de las más comunes debía ser felicidad de uso de tomar el tubo de contenedor pequeño llenado con varios objetos únicos de la persona que toma quiere copiar. Se necesita una bruja como esta, la de la acción mágica. Este encanto tiene dos de ventajas. Es imposible conseguir una experiencia totalmente única. Y la naturaleza recipiente le vuelve bastante inestable. El anillo. Mi disipación, la joya aceptoria, famosa creación de un clan en el que intentaba dejarse una quilla de bruja, también llamada anillo de cancelación mágica. La madre del lago se le entregó a la escena de despacho de recuperó después del viaje a la nueva estenda. Es decir, no creen como su, su cuidadora. Este cabrón quiere el anillo, quiere el anillo para tener esos poderes. How many years? <laughs> what? How many years has this been going on? Too... Too many. But I, I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just... I... It just... Oh, God! <laughs> Para mí miente. Are you all right? <laughs> We found the photos of you and Lily. I know, I know. That's that was. I just. I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and and I'm sorry. I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Llegó tu fin. Bigby. I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not. He wouldn't be brave enough not to put his stamp on the world like that. He's a disgusting coward, not a murderer. Thank you, my dear. It means so much to. Shut up. Don't talk to me. Okay. Okay, what do you mean? You don't think he did it at all? If you'd seen the room... I don't need to see the room. There's a lot he has to answer for. There's a lot we all have to answer for. This is different, Snow, and you know it. You said you found nomás. evidence of him defrauding Fabletown, of using our money for his own oh, puede haber un... ambitions. Alguien That's más. one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? Yes, I know how this. Why El único sospechoso que tenemos. Covering his tracks. He thought he was being framed, and maybe he is. There's nobody else that's even remotely. He's the prime suspect. There Exacto. is nobody else. But why? Really? Think about it. Because circumstantial evidence is one thing, and I won't kill a man for that. He glamoured a prostitute to look like you. He played out his sick fucking fantasies over and over. We can't condemn people to death for just being gross. Snow, and I... And no evidence that says anything except he was in the same room at some point in time. He embezzled millions from Fabletown, Bigby. That's what I have to care about. And that's enough. I was going to pay all of that back. Snow, why are you defending him? I'm not. I'm defending the order of things, Sheriff. You can hate him. I do. 
But I want him brought in for what he did to this town, and not killed by you for personal preference. Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses, but as of right now, you're coming with us. Get the fuck up. Now. I guess we know who's in charge, Sheriff. Sometimes it's fuzzy. You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of the nariz. <laughs> No. He took a little something back oh, what turn, yeah. So be it. I have no regrets. Better save your energy, huh? You're going away for a long time. Hasta que se muera. Blanco, que no te dé pena ese hombre. Ah, lo atrapamos, pero... Tengo duda igual. Sigo teniendo dudas si realmente él es asesino o no. Puede tener cómplice o... ¿Puedo ver un asesino más? Mira, 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 mira. Viene hacia nosotros. Oye, el viejo se escapa. No. Nos rodean. Hi. What you got there? Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're How shall I put this? Attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds. Pissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Guys? Speak English? Who no are English. You? Oh. No, 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 no. That's not how this works. How this works is you are going to walk Crane over here, like a good doggy. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Tweedledee, what's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mundies call me? Wha what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh... Bloody, Bloody Mary. Mary, that's it. Thank you. Maria you Sangrienta. Know why they call me that. Because some of them, idea. they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs. Vale, perdón, voy a hacer un corte. Continuemos. To the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. My golf to relax. This is my job. I like my job. So think about what I'm gonna do to you, your girl, and the rest of your friends if you don't hand over the sock puppet now. He's in custody, so move your car. I told you he'd never just give him up. Fuck it. Oh, 
Uh, alcancé a esquivarlo. Uh. Que te dé la weá. Lo voy a hacer mierda. Lo voy a hacer mierda. herido mierda rápido Chao. La bala de ese de plata. Mira, es de plata. Rápido. Uh, no, no se alenta. I know it sounds ridiculous, but really, guys, <laughs> can you argue with these results? Mierda. Because I know I can't. Mierda, no. La matar. Stop. Ay, me duele el dedo. Just take me, okay? Take Crane. Just. Stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Yes. Get out of here. Are you no monkey? That's your lucky day, kid. The crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no killer. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Nope, not like your boyfriend here. Oh, 
A beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long live the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. Bueno, parece ser que terminamos con este episodio 3. Sí. He's lucky to be alive, and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody, I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to, um, about last night. When people hear what you did to Dumb, they're going to think you've gone back to your old ways. Don't hold out on me, Jack. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point, do you? Wow, el episodio 4 se pone muy interesante, eh? Y bueno, estas son las lesiones del juego. Y bueno, lo primero que hice, interrumpiste el... El elogio de Blanca, todo el 80% de los jugadores decidieron no interrumpir el elogio de Blanca. Bien, ¿y esto? ¿En qué lugar investiga primeramente? Tú y 39% de los jugadores investigan en el departamento de Grey primera. Mira, ok. Hiciste trato con Jack. Tú y el 70% de los jugadores decidieron hacer un trato. Le ofreciste un trabajo. Atrapa, atrapa mosca, tú y el 96% de los jugadores le ofrecieron un trabajo a atrapa mosca. Quemaste el árbol de Ken, tú y el 79% de los jugadores no quemaron el árbol de Ken. Mataste a Talara, tú y el 44% de los jugadores mataron a Talara. Talara, como se diga. Y bueno, estas fueron las decisiones que he tomado. Parece que la gran mayoría eh, la ha tomado igual que yo. Pero bueno, el último de matar uno de los dos gemelos, no estoy, arrep no estoy en arrepentido en absoluto. Porque me tenían alto ya. Ellos iban a seguir con lo suyo. Si dejaba a los dos vivos. Yo creo que matar a uno. Fue una buena decisión. Porque ellos iban a seguir con lo, con lo suyo. Hasta matarme. Hasta matar a Lupo. Y bueno. Ahora que el otro tipo está solo. Quizás va a estar ahí deprimido. No sé. Quizás no me va a molestar más. O quizás sí. Va a querer venganza. No lo sé. Me da igual. Pero bueno. Este fue el episodio 3, espero que les haya gustado, si es así, les favorito para el episodio 4, que realmente se pone muy interesante. Y bueno, me despido, sigo en las redes sociales, y lo veremos en el episodio 4 de The Wall of Us. Chao a todos.